Hello everybody, my name is Missy Elise and welcome back to another Crafternoon. Today is the first day of our summer reading program, Reading Colors Your World. And in order to complete the challenge, all you need to do is read six books with a cover in each color of the rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Let's learn a little bit more about these colors by making a complimentary colors bouquet. Inside your kits you will find six popsicle sticks, six foam flowers, and six buttons in red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. You will also need glue and a green washable marker. Now you're ready to assemble your complimentary colors bouquet. But what are complimentary colors? In order to understand complementary colors, we first need to know a little bit more about the individual colors. First, we have the primary colors, red, yellow, and blue. Primary colors are basic colors that can be mixed together to make other colors. Those colors are called secondary colors. If you mix red and yellow, you get orange. If you mix yellow and blue, you get green. And if you mix red and blue, you get purple. Red, yellow, and blue are primary colors, and orange, green, and purple are secondary colors. All of these colors make up the color wheel. When these colors are arranged in a circle, there is a color that's directly across the circle from each color. These are complementary colors. So across the circle from red is green. Red and green are complementary colors. Across the circle from orange is blue. Orange and blue are complementary colors. Across the circle from yellow is purple. Yellow and purple are complementary colors. To make our complementary color bouquet, we'll need to glue the green button to the red flower, the blue button to the orange flower, the purple button to the yellow flower, the red button to the green flower, the orange button to the blue flower, the yellow button to the purple flower. Set your flowers aside to dry. While we're waiting, take your green washable marker and color your popsicle sticks. These will be the stems for your bouquet. Once the flowers are dry, glue them onto your popsicle stick stems. Set them aside to dry again. Once they are dry, stick them in a jar and use them as decoration or use them to practice recognizing your complementary colors. Now that you know your complementary colors, make sure to stop by the library to pick out some books with covers and all the colors of the rainbow so that you can complete our summer reading program. You have from June 7th to July 18th to complete your reading. And don't forget to sign up for some of our colorful programs as well. Check out our website, chillicothepubliclibrary.org, for details. That's all the time that we have for Crafternoon today, but I will be back again with another craft. But until then, take care, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye.